Andy. An elderly man is alive tonight thanks to some quick action by a Fort Wayne couple. State Trooper James Bailey and his wife Amy, who happens to be a nurse, were certainly in the right place at the right time. News Channel 15's Chris Hopper joins us now with their heroic story. Yeah, Heather, you and I called these two heroes for their response this weekend, but Trooper Bailey and his wife say they were just doing their jobs. On Saturday afternoon, I was coming out of the uh, restaurant. I had gotten in my car with my wife. We had just finished up eating. Ironically, the two had just finished a meal at the Lucky Moose in the DuPont Crossing Center. Instead of driving the opposite way on DuPont Road, Trooper James Bailey decided to go toward Coldwater Road. That's when people started waving and flagging him down to help an 87-year-old man who had collapsed. We then provided team CPR. She, my wife provided the breaths and I provided chest compressions until Fort Wayne Fire Engine number 16, I believe, arrived. After relieving the Baileys, medics were finally able to get a pulse and take the man to the hospital. Luckily, Trooper Bailey was driving his police car off duty because the people looking for help spotted his vehicle immediately. He saw the man had collapsed in this area over here. That's when he and his wife pulled up and immediately started performing CPR. They allow us to drive it off duty and uh, had I not been in that, I might not have been flagged down. James and Amy's quick response was instrumental in saving the man's life. But don't bother calling them heroes. Really, it's what we do. It's what we're trained to do. And that's why you get in this profession. It's also important to recognize the efforts of the medics from TRA and the firefighters from Engine 16. As well, as far as the man goes, he's still listed in critical but stable condition. Okay, but he is alive thanks yeah. to their efforts. Exactly. Thank you, Chris. Sure.